Alright, welcome back. Today I have got you an awesome video. This is a update video for check RAN. For those of you that already use RAN USB, this is a modified version of RAN USB. So you can jailbreak your iPhone using different version of check RAN. For RAN USB, it only has one version, but with mode RAN, it allows you to use check RAN different version. You have um, a variety of version, so you can choose the version that you like. So you have more choices when you are using mode RAN. So all you have to do is download this file. As I told you, it is a modified version of RAN USB. So you can download either AMD or Intel. For me, I have Intel, so I need to download the Intel one. And you can download from the link in description. And then you can see the RAR file. So all you have to do is right click and extract the file. And then you would be able to see the folder here. So the file is about 800 megabyte, and then you need your USB. And for me, I recommend you using 8 gigabyte of USB, so it is enough for this file. After that, you can plug in your USB into your PC. You need to run Balana software to create bootable USB. So you can use either Transmac or Balana software, but for me, I recommend you using Balana software, so it is much faster than Transmac. So all you have to do, right click on the software and run it as administrator and then it will pop up, so click on yes. And now you can see this window, so click on select image and then go to desktop, so you need to find the file that you have just downloaded. For me, I have placed mode RAN on desktop, so I can go to this folder and here is the file, I can select on it. Then it will automatically select my USB, so I can leave it as default. And finally, we can click on flash. For this process, it may take about 3 minutes or so. And now you can see the process is complete. So you will see the message on the top. So you can see flash complete. And you can see here. So now we need to restart our PC. So you can right click and then click on restart. When your PC turn black, you can press on F12 to go to BIOS. And for me, I have that laptop. However, if you have different laptop, you gonna click on or you gonna press on different key like HP. You need to go. You can press on Escape to go to BIOS, and sometimes you can um, press on F2 or F12 or Delete key. So it is depend on your computer. You can check it on Google. So there are many resources about that. Now you are standing in BIOS. 
so you can see different boot so we have legacy boot and UEFI boot so you need to boot from UEFI boot it is depend on your PC or your laptop as well so sometimes you can boot using legacy and sometimes you can use um, UEFI boot however for my PC I use UEFI boot so it is uh, much better now I can go to UEFI boot and here is my USB and then you can hit on enter after that you will jump into this page so you need to boot from mode RAM you can see the title below here so and then we can hit on enter key or return key and then we should boot into um, check RAM so you need to wait and if you see the script always moving so it means your computer is support however if it's stuck and for a long period of time so it may doesn't work for your PC so you need to try on the other one After that, if you see this message, it means your trackpad doesn't work. So you need to connect additional USB mouse. So for me, I have already connected to my computer. And I can move my mouse, as you can see. So we can click on this button. And then we can choose the language. So go to English. And now, and now continue. Now you can see RAN USB. And now you can see RAN USB. And as I told you, it is a... Uh, modify version of RAN USB. Now you can go on the top. So if you don't see, click um, one more time and then if you saw on the top, go to utility and then click on terminal and then you can see this page. Now on terminal, you can click on cell and then go to new window and now click on home brew. And now with this pop up, you need to type to start text and then hit on enter. You can see um, more RAN pop up. So you can expand, click on the plus button and now we can expand, expand it to full screen and you should be able to see this and then you can see the command below. So what you need to do, you need to type to start text and then you can uh, minus and then you can add the version. So there are many versions on check RAN. So we have 0.9, we have um, 0.9.8, so we have um, 0.9 up to up to 0 0.10.0 let's say I want to use check then 0 0.9 I just tie you can see I just tie to start text minor 0 0.9 and then I can hit on enter so you can see the check then 0 0.9 pop up on the screen here you can see and if I don't want to use that version I can um, close it and then uh, we can try the other one so let's say I want to use um, the new version, so I can type choose start text. And now you can see um, the new version, so you can see check run the beta one, so we have 0.10.0. So now we can begin the jailbreak. So I just um, connect my phone to the PC. So for this version, it doesn't support, so I just uh, need to put my phone into recovery mode um, manually. So I just um, power it off. And then I can power it back on. And keep holding the home button, so we can put our iPhone into recovery mode. And here we go. So now I can begin to jailbreak. So I can click on start. And I can start. So now we can begin. And you can see here. So we have check RAN logo, so it seems to be um, fully working. Now we have check RAN on home screen, you can open it up. And for me, I have already installed side here. That's why it's already installed side here. So you can see side here is working. 
Finally, thanks for watching. I would like to thank to CheckRent team who working very hard on CheckRent. So they allow us to jailbreak iOS 13 without no problem. And one more thing I would like to thank for just a touch. He also a YouTuber as well and he make um, this modified version from Rent USB. And I also thank um, Rent USB as well. And all of those developers and all of them I created in the description. You can check them out. And finally, thanks for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one.